unsolved murders. Both cases very concerning for the police and the public and the, and the family of the victims as well. Today, it's hard to believe that these two locations were a crime scene. Here around three weeks ago, where police found Huey Houston's cab. And here near Hunter Park, where police found David Grubbs a year ago in 10 days. It's at Hunter Park that I find Michael Grubbs, David's father. Not a moment goes by I don't think about him. I try to keep busy. We all do. Sitting at David's memorial, he remembers the best of his child. He always loved to joke. He loved to quote funny movies. He loved his music. The loss of both men took their toll not only on families, but on our communities as well. It's really scary. Even in the last year, there's more crime than I've ever seen in Medford. Both cases are still considered active, and in relation to Houston's homicide, police say they believe there are still witnesses who have not yet come forward. I think it, it concerns them to be a possible witness in such a serious case, but what should be more important is, is getting this killer off the street. And while Michael Grubbs is grateful for the help that the community gives his family and police in attempting to solve his son's case, he wishes it was enough. I can't thank them enough, but I would rather not thank them at all. I would rather just have David back. Jennifer Elliott, NBC5 News.